day, Teresa. May the Lord watch over you, Tess. God safe. What else was it you wanted from me? You brought that beer to hell. I did. Uh huh. And what did he say? He said thanks. That's about it. Huh. That's just like him. All right. But now I can tell you what I wanted. Fancy a walk in the woods? Right now? You want to court me in the shade of the pines? <laughs> no. I need to pick herbs for distilling schnapps. Henry's favorite. What herbs do you need? I've got almost everything, except belladonna. I know a clearing where the best plants grow. Belladonna? But that's deadly poison. It is, if you don't know what you're doing. But don't worry, I haven't poisoned anyone yet. Henry's favorite, I see. Yes, I'd like to give it to him tomorrow. I might have known it'd be about Henry again. Well, you know how it is, Tess. Don't worry, you'll find a fellow one day. That's easy to say when you work in a tavern where there are fellows swarming around you all day. All I see at the mill are sacks of flour. What about Zbyshek? Zbyshek? I'd rather settle for a sack of flour. Hmm, I suppose. Your pa would never let Zbyshek have you anyway. Not long ago, when he had a few too many, I heard him say how he was going to get you the richest husband for miles around. Oh, pa. I hope that was just the beer talking. Why don't you go and pick it yourself? Pa won't let me go on my own. They say a wolf was seen in the woods recently. A wolf? Hereabouts? So they say. But it was old Blaha who claimed to see it, and he's never sober. Still, I wouldn't want to go there alone. Couldn't your brother go with you? Adam? He'd shit himself if he saw a wolf. And besides, someone has to take care of the tavern. But he could lend us his bow. Good thinking, Tess. Uh, thanks? So, you're going to borrow a bow from Adam, and then you want me to go with you to pick Belladonna in the woods? Actually, it's not entirely that simple. Adam won't lend me his bow. The last time he did, I broke the string. You'll have to get it from him. Anyway, I don't know how to shoot, but Stibor taught you, didn't he? Yeah, but that was a long time ago. It doesn't matter. If the wolf sees a bow, he won't come near us. So will you go and ask Adam? You know he's always liked you. Just give him a wink and the bow is yours. You might be able to do that with Henry, but me, well... Come now. You're as pretty as any lass in the province. And once you've got the bow, meet me on the bridge by the lake, all right? All right, I'll deal.
Greetings, herbs, Tess. ointments, all freshly prepared. Yo, Honka, what's up? I was asking around for you. There's something we have to talk about. Are you going to the dance this evening? I'd like to go and have a look, if I have time for it. Why? Do you want to borrow my dress? No, no, nothing like that. I've got a dress, but I don't want to end up dancing on my own, if you know what I mean. You want me to find you a dancing partner? No, not quite. I've already picked one. Mm, let me guess. Matthias? I? Who else? So, what's the problem? Just go and tell him. You've had your eye on him since the Harvest Festival. Surely you must have noticed by now. He hasn't. I'm at a loss what to do. Can't you just go and invite... You must be joking. What if he doesn't like... No, not a chance. So you'd like me... That's right. How in heaven's name do you want to do it then? Easy. You're going to steal his lucky dice. What? How is that supposed to help, for Christ's sake? If you can get your hands on it without him noticing, he'll be looking everywhere for it. He'll be wandering around saying to himself, Where did I put that damned dice? And then, I'll turn up. God be with you, Matthias. You didn't by any chance lose your dice. And he'll say, Aye, Johanka, I did. Where on earth did you find it? Oh, I found it near the tavern. You know there's going to be a dance there this evening. And then he'll finally get the message. Oh, the dance. Yes. Johanka, wouldn't you like to go with me? Of course. I'd love to go with you, Matthias. Thank you for asking. Then he'll take me by the hand and he'll look... <clears throat> Never mind that. Um... Well... That's how it's going to help, more or less. You can't be serious. That will never work. It will? Please, Tess. He loves that dice of his. He'll be overjoyed when I give it back to him. All right, then. I'll help you. Thank you, Tess. Bring... Hang on, though. How am I supposed to find it? He was saying at the tavern yesterday that he keeps it in his trunk when he's not going to play. Go and see Fritz first. I heard he's always got some lockpicks, whatever he wants them for. Anyway, no doubt he can show you how to use one. Me? Pick locks? Yohonka, aren't you going a bit too far? Well, then maybe you can get hold of his key somehow. But whatever you do, don't get caught. And not a word to Matthias. Come right up, good people. Herbs for your kitchen, as well as health-giving decoctions. Good day, Teresa.
hell was that? Come right up, good people. What was that noise? Something you're looking for, yeah? You sit bare arsed in the cold and read. You pile of manure! Should I muck out stables like you? Is that what you call an honourable profession? How Even are the you, horses are more fragrant than you. Honest work doesn't stink, you good for nothing. Perhaps not. But you think so, I have. How are you? What's new, Fritz? I don't know. Oh, actually, I do know. There's going to be a dance this evening. Are you going? Maybe. I've got a lot to do still. They say it's going to carry on tomorrow, too. And they'll be roasting a pig. Can't miss that. So I heard. I wonder how come Sir Radzig allowed it. No, it wasn't his lordship's idea. It was Master Faithfar's. Master Tobias? Why would he do that? I don't know. Maybe he just wants to show off his wealth. I'd have roast pig and dancing every evening if I had his coin. Listen, Fritz, I hear you know something about opening locks without a key. Sure. All you have to do is charge at the door. Shoulder first. I don't want to break down a door. I want to pick a lock. Ah, you want a lock pick then? Shh, not so loud. Well, I can give you some. But you know what they say. Not even a pig grunts for free. That's the stupidest thing I ever heard. Who says that? Ah, uh, mostly me. And everyone thinks it's fucking clever. So bugger off. Hey, Fritz, after all we've known... All right, but just this time. If you break them, don't expect to get more for free. Just two? You said a couple. Will you teach... Sure. Is this enough? That's not enough. All right. Well... A little more. It's easy as fuck, unless you're all thumbs. Listen, you've got to find a spot where the... Nice and light, though. 
No jerky movements. I get it. Thanks. kitchen, as well as health-giving decoctions. What? They'll help with every pain and ailment. Jesus Christ! Your clothes are a mess. Did you fall down or something? About Matthias. Yes? Tell I've brought you his dice. I knew you'd do it! Thanks! This is great! I'll bring it- Whatever the ailment, I've got the remedy. That sounded like... Come right up, good people. Herbs for your Jesus. kitchen. As well as health-giving decoctions. God be with you, Matthias. Listen, I found this dice. I believe it's yours. My dice? But how? I thought it was in my trunk. No, I found it outside. It was lying on the ground by the tavern, where the dance is going to be this evening. That's odd. I could have sworn I put it away. Can I have it back? People will be dancing all around there. They'd trample it into the ground for sure. It's a good thing I spotted it. Although, I don't suppose I'll be dancing this evening. No one's asked me. I see. Uh, the dice, please? I'd put on a very pretty dress. And after the dance, I'd walk home with the boy who danced with me, if anyone asked me. I'll take you, all right? God be with you, Teresa. And you'll Teresa. give me my dice back. Really? You take me? Yeah. All right. Thanks. I'll see you this evening. Right. Sure. Wait. God what about my dice? Oh, for the love of God. 